So you just started your YouTube channel and you wanna get even more subscribers. You wanna give the people watching your videos every opportunity to subscribe to your channel. But did you know that one very powerful way is to add a clickable subscribe button directly to your video? In today's video, we're gonna go over the steps to add an embedded subscribe button. Make sure to stick around until the end of the video because I have a very special tip for another way you could start making money passively online. So make sure you don't skip a second. Welcome to Entrepreneur's Toolbox. I'm Jonathan and I'm here to help you find the tools to build an income online. If you get value out of these videos, make sure that you like and subscribe and don't forget to ring the bell so you get notified every time that I upload a new video. First off, one thing to note is that it's not always clickable on mobile, but I've tested it on several mobile devices and all of them have at least shown the icon to subscribe. The icon isn't embedded into the video, so it may not always be in the exact same spot on the screen. But if somebody is on YouTube on their computer, the icon is interactive and they just have to click it. So in 2020, they're actually phasing out the old YouTube creator. And we have the YouTube studio and I actually started on YouTube right as the transition was happening. So this is what I knew. So I've been figuring it out on the studio side and not on the YouTube, like the creator side, the old creator studio. So I'm just gonna walk you through a couple steps. So I go to YouTube and here's YouTube studio. And it's actually very simple. You just go to settings and you wanna go to channel and then you go to branding. You can do it the entire video, you can do it at a custom time or just at the end of the video. And to add icon, it doesn't actually have to say subscribe. A lot of people use actually their branding and that's what it's actually meant for. So if you wanted to create like a custom subscribe button that maybe has your brand and says subscribe, you could do that here as well. And uh, it says replace for me, but you just be able to add it if you haven't ever added it in the first place. So it's really that simple. And when you add that, it adds a very small little icon and I'll show that to you in a moment. To find one of these icons, just make sure that you're not taking something that has a copyright on it. Uh, just search for something that's like copyright free. Uh, you can find a lot of these things on, actually on YouTube, a lot of people, they, they put a video, you can take a screenshot of it, like these green screens that you, you're seeing in this example. Uh, but just make sure that it does not have any copyright protection on it. Uh, otherwise somebody could flag it. It may not happen, but do you really wanna take that risk? So now that you've saved your subscribe button and you've uploaded it in the branding, you'll just wanna hit save. I'll hit close because I've already, I haven't made any changes. And then I'll just show you. So when you go to your channel. Sales funnels are an amazing way to increase it. So you can see it added it here. Now it says subscribe, but this is my channel. So I'm gonna show you what it looks like from a different account. So I just logged into my other YouTube account. This is actually, my original YouTube account from before Google even owned YouTube. So it's a, it's an old one. So as you can see, I just hovered the mouse over the icon and it gives me the option to subscribe. And I just have to click it and then I'm subscribed. Just give as many options as possible. And also in the comments, let me know if you're gonna try and use this trick. When you have viewers on your channel, you need to give them every opportunity to hit that subscribe button. Also, if you want a step-by-step -step guide on how to make passive income online using affiliate marketing, make sure you check out the first link in my description. Are you gonna take advantage of these extra subscribe buttons on your YouTube videos? Let me know in the comments and I will see you in the next one.